We're going to turn now though to Chautauqua County and seven news getting exclusive access to the largest active road construction project in our region. It's a major bridge rehab happening over Chautauqua Lake. You can see the view from above here. It is a big deal, but it's also been a big inconvenience. Seven news is a voice for everyone. So we're hearing tonight from a frustrated business owner and some residents in addition to the state DOT. The state sharing with us that some relief is on the way. 7 News reporter Maki Becker covers Chautauqua County for us, and she is right now on the Interstate 86 bridge over Chautauqua Lake. We're getting an up close look at the massive rehabilitation project that's underway on this entire bridge. It's the biggest engineering project for the State Department of Transportation in Western New York. By money uh, and original budget, this is the largest project that we have going on in Region 5 right now. The price tag, $78 million. And for a second summer in a row, workers have been busy on this half century old bridge. Check out this amazing bird's eye view from our drone. There are some times when we need to close down the bridge entirely. In general, we are doing that at night. That's why you don't see any construction workers here. But take a look. This is fresh concrete just poured overnight and they're spraying water over it so it doesn't dry too quickly. You guys ready? Yeah. Okay. We also got a look at the work being done under the bridge. This is the this is the bottom of the superstructure. This project was supposed to be completed next year. Now we're saying that we expect to be finished with the complete project by the end of 2027, which is a little later than our original goal. The ongoing construction has been a pain for folks who rely on this bridge. It's taken way too long um, and it's an inconvenience. It's been especially tough on some Bemis Point businesses. People can't get to us. They completely severed our off ramp. So normally the exit ramp lets you off right on Main Street, right by Tammy Shack's store, but that exit is closed. 13,000 cars a day pass over that and could not get down to me. But very soon that should change. This is the old off ramp to Bemis Point, and it had to be closed during this phase of construction. But take a look over here. You can see workers putting the finishing touches on what's going to be the new temporary off ramp that'll be open through the rest of this project. We took action and hopefully that will alleviate some of the stress that has been put on the business district in Bemis Point. For more information on closures and detours, go to my story at WKBW.com. Maki Becker, 7 News on the I-86 bridge across Chautauqua Lake. And Maki covers Chautauqua County for us, so if there is a story there that you want her to know about, you can just scan the QR code right on the screen behind me. It gives you all of her contact info, or you can just email maki.becker at wkbw.com.